33-year-old father of two, Dylan Langridge, and 36-year-old Trevor Davis went to work and didn't come home. They were employed by contractor Barminko at the Dougald River zinc mine owned by MMG, 65 kilometres out of Cloncurry. Everyone knows somebody that works at a mine and it highlights even though there's a high level of safety at all these mines, it's still a really high risk industry. The day started as a delicate rescue operation in a dangerous environment, 125 metres underground. Loved ones prayed for the best. It rocks the industry to the core and it really does bring into sharp focus the fragility of life. The two men were driving a ute underground when it fell 15 metres to the bottom of a large cavern known as a stope. A drilling rig also fell, but the operator was able to escape safely. Rescuers found the ute at the bottom of the stope and started removing rubble. Our approach today is to continue to safely remove material from around the vehicle so we can safely extract it. But several hours later, the bodies of the two miners were discovered. MMG and Barminko say they're offering support for the colleagues and families of the two men. The incident is a disturbing reminder of the dangers facing underground workers in a region heavily reliant on the mining industry. Well, it makes you feel sad when I've got two family working out there. At this time, uh, our thoughts are with uh, the family of these two men. Investigations into what caused the fatal fall will continue as loved ones and colleagues grieve. Julia Andre, ABC News, Cloncurry.